Hi, welcome back to Fighting 50, and we've got Nikki back! Yay! I feel like we should do the winning dance. Yeah, it's exactly. It's been so long. I know. I don't even know how long it's been so long. Months. Months and months and months. No, I'm back, and I'm back with full force, and um, we've had a busy day already, and it's only yeah. almost time. It's only half past 12. Yeah, we've been a rather interesting press event. Yeah, a press event this morning with um, an aesthetic doctor. Um, who's written a book actually, which I'm sure we'll talk about, but some very we'll interesting. Definitely be on the it's on our, our wavelength anyway, isn't it? Because it is. it's about more natural kind of look. Okay, so, so you've been so busy, no doubt you've been shopping. I've been shopping, and also um, for those of you who have welcomed me back, thank you. For those of you who don't know me, um, I have been a beauty expert and in the industry for over 30 years and I currently work um, with a consultancy launching lots of brands, as you know. Pretty exciting. Um, and I do all their training, so um, I'm the Which is why director. she's never here. Which is why I'm never here, yeah. So the first um, brand I want to show you, um, and it's one of our brands um, that I work with, that I train, is a new makeup line. Ooh, exciting. So. Those of you that are fans of the videos will know that I'm a massive, massive Korean beauty fan. Yep. And um, we have just launched into the UK market at the consultancy the first ever full Korean makeup line. So have we never had a full line here? We've had bits and pieces. We've but... mainly had skincare. Skincare, and actually I'm going to talk about something later, but skincare... Um, or the odd lip gloss kind of thing, but never a full no, makeup no, line. Range, okay. um, now, following the lines of regular K Beauty, Korean make, Korean Beauty, the key with this line is its innovation, its formulas, but also its. They're colours. just streets ahead, really. Aren't they're they? on average, they're about ten years ahead wow. in technology, and also um, interesting enough, a lot of the industry um, also has funding from the government in South Korea, so they? they really take it seriously. That's really and interesting. you will see more and more um, Western brands having Korean technology. So um, we were really excited um, to launch this brand. It's literally launched about two weeks ago on Cult Beauty, wow. and this week on ASOS. So I bought you my three favourite products. So one of the things that they are really big on in Korea, I've just got to check that I can you can see this, is primers. And we love a primer. We love a primer and this is called Feels Like Honeymoon Skin Base. That's what it's actually called. Yeah, they do. Have, like they do have crazy names. Um, the brand actually, I haven't even told you the brand name. The brand is called Touch and Soul. Um, now, what you will see. Can you see the little? It is, it has literally a honey effect and little, little, you can see it, encapsulated gold flakes. So, what you do is take a small amount, this goes on after your skincare and you, it smells amazing. Oh God, I love the smell. You smell. can see. It's not tacky in the least. No, it looks tacky, but it's not. So you pat it on. This isn't tacky at all. It's almost got a slightly um, wet feel. Like it's like a gel. really moisturising. This it's one, like a gel serum. This kind of one thing. is hydrating, firming. It has honey, it has rose. It smells it's amazing. Oh, amazing. And it leaves the skin... It's lovely. ...firmer and brighter, but also with that kind of adherence. Look incredibly soft as well. Yeah, so super smooth for your foundation to go on, whether you're doing a tinted moisturiser, a BB cream, a foundation powder, liquid, anything like that. Um, I rather like the spatula. Spatula is fabulous. Um, so yeah, so that is the feels like honeymoon skin base. So that is the primer for, I would say, more mature, drier skin. Um, the other one I don't have with me, which is is the top set, it's called No Problem. No problem. No problem. <laughs> and that is for kind of texture and open pores. Okay. That would could, that be for a slightly oilier skin? Could maybe? be younger, could be oilier, or as we often get questions, as we age and the skin loses elasticity, sometimes the pores become yeah. more apparent. So yeah. those two are the, uh, the top two. So feels like honeymoon skin base and no problem. Is it expensive? 1950. Well, it's not bad. Yeah, it goes a long way. I mean, 
You'd expect to pay that for a good brand. Now, we've just bought the brand to the UK, as I said, and this product, several of them launched in the US in Sephora a little, a uh, few months ago, and this became the top selling mascara. And it's called Stretch X. Now, Ooh, I like the name. It actually does. Let me just show you the brush. It's got a tiny. What's it? <laughs> tiny brush so with a slight curve, as a lot of Asian mascaras do. So it really it stretches. It has elastic fibres in there really? that pull through and give volume, uh, not volume, give length to the lash. Because a lot of um, it's not clumpy or anything. No, it doesn't have does anything it? like that in there. Because of a lot of um, a lot of Asian ladies have shorter lashes, so this is about giving uh, length. Which obviously, you know, I don't like a thick, clumpy mascara. This is really pulls through and really gives a smooth effect. I love the sound of this. What's interesting about it is that um, warm water. And it tubes, oh, it tubes off. off. Yeah. Brilliant. Oh, yeah. I love that. Yeah. Especially when you're travelling. Yeah, absolutely. If you're travelling, you don't then have to take yeah. an eye So water resistant, but then we'll come off with warm water. Yeah. Um, and that's £18. So that is the Stretch X. It's really, really I love the packaging. Yeah, really well. cool. You'll see when you How see the whole brand. 18. 18. Mm. I'm going to buy one of these. When you see the whole mascara. brand, the packaging, they talk about it being disruptive. Everything's different. Yeah. So it doesn't have a consistent look, like you know. And then finally, um, this is a winner. This is the... Oh, this well. You do want this. <laughs> this is the Touch Insole Metalist Eyeshadow Duo Glitter and Foil. This comes in five different shades and they're double-ended, as you can see. And what you do is you first of all apply the cream end. And you can use it from the um, wand or with a brush. And that gives you, you can see, that kind of metallic foil. Okay? Then you go in, and let me just show you, it has a little wand kind of thing. So like a little flat spatula. Yeah. You literally, I'm trying to watch and do it at the same time, you pat. We're trying a new technique here to see if we can give you a better view you of the products. Can you see that glitter? It's gorgeous. Now what is interesting with this product is two things. Once it's on, it does not move. And secondly, it's the only product that I've ever tried with this kind of glitter that you don't feel like you've got anything on. Okay. Normally with glitter eyeshadows, you know, you feel like you've got glue yeah, yeah, stuck you to your feel. eyelids. So that is the kind of glitter finish. God, it's and so pretty. There's, this oh, is the lightest colour. Once it's on, it doesn't move, no, does it? No, it doesn't move. This is the lightest colour and actually there is a gold, a bronze, this one's called Talia. A gold, a bronze, a more ready shade. Put a tiny bit on. Yeah. Can you see? Yeah. You only need a very small yeah. amount. But it doesn't, look. We're going to have all our hands in the, in the picture now. It just yeah, doesn't move. You can see that shine. It's like a magnetic. Yeah. Beautiful. In fact, you can see it actually. Look at that on my fingers. Yeah. So, yeah. It's gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. And that is £20. Yeah. I'm going to buy one of these yeah. as well. Yeah. Okay. So, those. What's the £38 you just spent for me? Every time we get together, she costs me £38. <laughs> She's not seen it for one. So, those are my three favourite from Touch and Soul. So, as I said, if you've got any questions about the brand, I do the education for the brand so I can answer them. Um, so, check out Cop Beauty and ASOS. And we just want it. We do. Great. Okay. Well, talking about primers as we were, this is the Ren Perfect Canvas. Recently been launched, and in fact, I have my own personalised bottle. Oh, oh, look at that. It was rather nice. I went to the launch and they had an artist there actually giving you a little um, personalised bottle. So it's got my initials on, it's got a little palm tree. I've got some others actually with some photographs that um, some of the girls had unicorns. Oh, <laughs> so this is a very... You're not a unicorn, no. No, I'm, I'm more of a palm tree, me. Yeah, than a unicorn. <laughs> so, Perfect Canvas, it's a very lightweight serum primer. It's, it's very different to any primer I've tried before. You don't need very much, you only need a couple of drops 
to actually cover your face. Now this is a probiotic formula and what it's doing is acting as skin care. I don't think it's got no, not really. Dog, it? It's acting as skincare as well as being a primer. So what it's doing is plumping, smoothing, filling in little bits of the gaps, and working to improve the condition of your skin. So it works immediately time. and long term. Yeah, absolutely. So you'll get a cumulative effect if you're using it all the time, and um, and an immediate effect under makeup. So it encourages cell. Uh, renewal, surface cell renewal, and it helps to balance moisture as well. So you're actually keeping your skin well moisturized while you're using it. So the one drawback with this, this is 30 mil. I love everything about it. I love the packaging. I absolutely love how it, it sits under. I don't really wear foundation at the moment. I'm still using the Pericone uh, No Foundation mm -hmm. Foundation Serum. It sits beautifully under that. It works under your SPF. It does everything you could ever ask for it to do. But it's fifty pounds. I saw it in Marks and Spencer's pounds. when it launched, and I have to say I was surprised at the price. Yeah. You know, I think that's quite a lot of money, but I have to say I love it. I've only used a couple of drops at a time, and I might actually be tempted to replace it when it's gone. Because obviously it has skincare benefits, but it's not going to replace your skincare. So it's not like Absolutely you can not. say no. that you could no. justify, I you mean, know, you could, swap it out. You could possibly swap out your serum. You could possibly. I mean, I have on days when I've just, um, I've put makeup and I've put SPF on, I've put a moisturiser on and this and an SPF and then the um, no foundation foundation serum but i i think in truth you would still want to do your serum mm. most days but occasionally it's certainly evenings you know if you're going out in the evening and you don't necessarily want to do your skincare again then it's great so that's perfect canvas i love it to bits but I do think 50 quid is quite a lot of money. It's a good idea, I think, if you're a Ren fan, you know. You know what I would do? I would do what I did with all of these things. I'd just wait until it looked fantastic or... Or Marks and Spencer's. Or Marks and Spencer's yeah. or one of the, the big retailers. When they do their 20% off, buy it then. That's mm -hmm. what I do the most of these things. Okay, that's Ren. Okay, my... Uh, next kind of batch of products are more skincare and actually as often i do it's kind of focused around weather and seasonal changes yep. now you will know if you are regulars that we are both fans of a dove fan let me just turn that around look how pretty that box is pretty 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 now this is a brand and these product uh, category i've worked with for many many years and i've recommended them so many times so i think we know that change of weather, change of heating, um, air con, screens, pollution, all these things stress our skin out and also make it sensitive and prone to redness. So these two, two products, if you have those problems, you want to pick them up and use them consistently. The other thing you can do so what is we got? Keep, got... them, keep them handy and then if you feel okay. you're having that stressed situation. So let's start with the serum. Okay. So this is the intro, which is the range, it's the pink range, it's the intro serum and it is literally, let me show you, one little pump. My hand's still a bit sparkly I'm afraid. I love the smell of these products as well. Oh my god, it's beautiful. And this has it's really beautiful but very very light so light so light that's almost like a water texture yeah isn't yeah it? yeah no oil no kind of weight to it now both it's of these products like essence, isn't it? yes yeah 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 interesting very you say that because both of these products have similar ingredients kind of to make them compatible chamomile peony and then also they have some kind of Asian inspired ingredient. So they have a ferment in there, they have a um, galactose amino glycans in there, which basically are going to strengthen the skin. And this next one is the anti redness cream. So this is very much a thicker cream if you're dry and wind and you know that tightness. 
That is a really nice So skin. comforting. Place so comforting on the skin. It's really comforting. It's a bit like putting a blanket oh, on. It is, it's it is. Blanket. It's like that cashmere blanket we've talked Beautiful about before. Beautiful fragrance, very fresh. And it's not overpowering by any means, is it? No, and interestingly so, as well, um, this one has copper PCA in as well, which we know is good for strength on copper. the skin. So. As I would say, you know, if you have that redness, whether it's a, a more of a rosacea or if it's kind of environmental redness, then you can use these two to three drops of the serum and then the cream and, you know, either the cream at night if you want something or you could use something lighter during the day or keep something like the cream in your kind of emergency, you know, you know, like if you go skiing and yeah. you get wind burn or anything like the that. The other thing I love about this, you can actually put that in your handbag. Yeah. You yeah, know, yeah, you're yeah. not looking at a ridiculous size no. that you couldn't carry. No. It. So the whole Pop idea is the, the whole of the intro brand calms the redness, suits, but also helps to strengthen the skin. So it's more resilient okay. against that kind of thing. Now, price wise, the serum is 55, um, but 30 ml, so it's a good size and the cream is 45. Fantastic. That is 50 mil. Great. Like 50 we'll put links where you can purchase the products at the bottom of the video. Yeah, and again, actually, you often find Darfan in some of the websites where you can get um, yeah. some, some deals sometimes. Okay. So, so, yeah. Fantastic. Now, another brand that we are passionate about, we've spoken about lots of times, lots of times even. That's it's, so big, you're big, hiding behind it. so big. Yeah, look. <laughs> Um, this is Kiss the Moon, and we've been following their progress. Nikki and I met the girls who founded the company when they very first started, and we've kind of followed their journey, and something that we both feel quite passionately about is that we do talk about the same brands again, because they're things that we're using, mm. things that we like, and we don't just kind of like, everything is new. It might be a new product, but it's a brand that we've been following for a long time. So Kiss the Moon, latest products just come out. This is their bedtime bath salts. It comes in two different fragrances. They glow and also, what was that one? Dream. Dream, that's it. It's so baby sachet, this one. Right, so you baby sachet trial size. And is this one bath? No, oh. because you only use one to two tablespoons for each bath. So this big pack, which is 400 grams, should do 10 to 12 baths. Okay. And I've been using it and you really do only need, it, it's not like taking, you know if you use Epsom salts, you, you use a lot of them. <laughs> so this has got Epsom salts, it's got Dead Sea salts in it, and so it's got a really good source of magnesium. Magnesium yeah. is what helps you sleep, it helps to stimulate serotonin, so, Add to that gorgeous orange and geranium. Oh, you've got to smell this. It's orange and you'll have to lift it up so you can have smell of vision. What do you mm. think? Isn't that beautiful? It's beautiful. It's very spa like. It's really spa like. And also, the fragrance really does um, fragrance the bathroom when you. Oh, and this was definitely sleep. Yeah. And that's you, isn't yeah, it? Dream. This, this is yeah. Nikki loves lavender. This is lavender and bergamot. And I don't like them. <laughs> so, no, you don't like them. So orange and geranium is definitely perfect for me. So twenty pounds for the large size, the four hundred grams. Five pounds for the smaller size. What size? This is fifty. Is it fifty? Yeah. Pounds? And uh, and that's a good way of trying it to see if you like it, see if you actually like the fragrance. But I actually had a bath in this. Actually, not last night, night before. And I had a really bad backache, I don't know why, but I'd had a um, backache. And I popped this in the bath, laid in the bath for sort of 10 minutes, and when I came out, my back didn't ache. So this one, <coughs> excuse me, says to ease muscles and yeah. nourish skin and soul. So you've also got a bit of coconut seed oil in here, which is helping to hydrate the body, keep your, you know, you, you feel, you don't get out of the bath and feel dry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Before you get out moisturized. So Kiss the Moon, Glow Bedtime Bath Salts. And, and Dream, and just a little bit. And just, just have a look at Kiss the Moon. They've got a gorgeous website. They're, they're lovely girls who started it. And um, we're really enjoying their journey, actually, because they're coming out with some really great products. So. 
Yeah, fantastic presence as well. And we just know. love having a good night's sleep. Yeah. Really, there's nothing better than a decent night's sleep. Okay. So, back to the skincare theme. Now, this is a product which you guys may have seen on Pinterest, social media. It gets a lot of social. And um, it's the Ceramidin. Let me show you by Dr. Jart, and this is the liquid. So, this is probably something you would recognize. Okay, there you go. Did you buy this on your travels? No, this is local. Is I it? bought this TK Max. See, oh, you can see. see you. Now, sometimes you can pick this up, but if not, it's in Selfridges now, actually, yeah, you do. in their Korean section. See, this is the clever thing if you watch our videos, you'll get all Mickey's tips. And then when you do go into TK yeah, Maxx, you yeah, know what you're looking yeah. for. Always take your phone into TK Maxx, make sure you've got Wi Fi, because I stand there and sometimes I forget my glasses, so I have to get my other half to read stuff to me. Um, and I'm like, Google this, let's see, because you often in places like TK Maxx, stuff might not be in English. Oh, that's true. So I have to Google everything. But no, this is a brand I've seen about for a long time. Now, the most common product you often see talked about is the cream, and that's too rich for me. So I managed to find the liquid. Now, how the name suggests is it's really rich in ceramides, oh, okay? okay? Now, ceramides is something, if you're our sort of age, you will associate with a certain brand that was, you know, very big in skincare in the 80s and 90s. Let me show you the texture, because although it says it's a liquid, it's like a serum lotion. It's interesting, isn't it? I oh, use on this thing, so I've got this gorgeous glitter. glittery. I use two drops yeah. whenever I need that buffered effect. Okay. Makeup sits fine over it. I don't necessarily put a thicker cream over the top. Um, the smell of so it is today. So it, it's a serum. Oh my yeah? god. It's smell. a serum. But for me, it's a moisturizer. It's enough serum. as a moisturizer serum. sometimes. Serum, no, serum. 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 serum, serum, moisturizing. They talk about it being a buffering cushion. Oh, well. Yeah, it's uh, uh, it is, there. and it's a massive bottle. Oh um, my God. They talk about it being a buffering serum, protects against chronic water loss, which we all suffer from oh, for this sure. Is so um, nice. It has time release effect. It has the ceramides, um, licorice root, which is anti redness. Let me show you the bottle again. I mean, I think the packaging is quite cool. It's not glamorous. Well, it's very pharmaceutical, it's cool. isn't it? Uh, chamomile, panthenol, panthenol to kind of strengthen the skin. And this is 150ml, and at Selfridges, it's, I think, £33, £34. Or if you're a smart cookie. Yeah, mine was 24 99 at TK Maxx, but that wasn't a, a, a couple well, of months okay. ago. Um, What's well, looking on the oh, website? Oh, totally. Yeah, the if you're super, yeah. super dry, look for the ceramidin cream um, rather than the lotion. Um, they also um, do masks and things in it as well, like sheet masks with the okay. same kind of formula. But love it. I just love it for that comfort, that buffering. Um, it's just... It feels beautiful. Yeah. It feels really beautiful. It's very, very, very soft, very nurturing. Um, so it's really but nice. not heavy, so your makeup, you can use it happily during the day. A lot of these creams that are very rich in ceramides, you can't really put makeup on, it tends to slide. Yeah. Um, so yeah, so gorgeous. that is Dr. Jart Ceramidin uh, Liquid. Fantastic. Now, new brand to me, but one that I'm just, oh God, I love this brand. Can we just take a moment to look at the packaging? Just look at this packaging. Can you see it? You can see it's all black. It's all black, but look, I just, I just think this is the coolest packaging. Isn't it nice? So, this is Suku. It's a Japanese makeup line. I mean, just just the sorted in packaging. Okay, you've seen enough of the packaging. And uh, some of the products just been sent through to me, and I've been using them the last few days. And oh my goodness, I just love them. First thing I want to show you is the gel liner. So you've got a gel liner, very very fine, at one end, and you've got a little blend or a gel blend. Don't know if you can. As you can see, it's teeny, it's teeny, teeny ended, tiny, and then you've got like a little buffing blend sponge on the end. So this, what I love about this is, let's hope you right. Look, don't know if you can see. It doesn't move. It just doesn't move. It doesn't doesn't move at all. 
uh, which I just think is fantastic. It's a nice... Uh, it's a really nice... Thing. Solid colour as well. It's solid, and it reminds me of the Hourglass mm. gel eyeliner, which I love to bits. Um, but again, it's quite expensive. Now this one is £20, the gel eyeliner. It's not cheap. Make sure I put the right hand in. It's not cheap, but it's beautiful. It lasts fantastically well. You can literally put it on in the morning and it's still there in the evening. Mm. It just doesn't move. And it's got the little blender. And I, I just think it's gorgeous. And also, you know, I know this is expensive, but this is the sort of thing I'd buy a girlfriend. Mm. Because if you're buying something for Christmas or a birthday, it looks gorgeous. You know, the packaging, look at the packaging, you know, beautiful packaging, gorgeous product, but a little bit pricey. Mm. But, you know, to be honest, I don't mind paying, paying for something if it really works. Yeah, I think it's an eyeliner. Really works. So, on to the next. Look at this. Again, same gorgeous packaging. Can you see? And this is a lip liner. But, look at this. It's refillable. Oh, so cool. you can buy the refill. I'm not even sure if they've got these in stock yet. They're just coming into Selfridges and they're, they're Selfridges exclusives. So you just clip that in. Now, just look at this lip liner. It's really, really beautiful. Can you see? Can you see that? So I think this is 05 and it's the Lip Defining Pencil. It costs £14. Um, the holder is £12, but I haven't been able to find the price of the refill yet. I will hopefully find that by the time um, I, I put all the information at the bottom of the video. There's five colours and it really does last. Mm. And it's great when your lips are starting to thin a bit. It's great for getting your um, lipstick to adhere and it just makes it last longer and better. And I, I but just look at this. I mean, the fact you can take it out, it just makes me so happy. Mm. <laughs> it just really it's not drying it. either. Quite it's not often, drying. Quite dry and dry. Uh, but also, it, it's again, I don't know if you can see this. I mean, it does move a little bit more than the, the gel liner, but it really, it really does last. Mm. And again, I think this is a, you know, such a lovely present. Girls, this is, might be what you're getting for Christmas. <laughs> um, just quickly, because I know we're getting, been here for a while. This is the, I'm just going to get the name right, the Extra Glow Lipstick. And these are the berry colours for Christmas. Highly pigmented. Yeah, look, beautiful packaging. And can you see this? No color? smell. Should, no, no smell. But it's got really um, high pigment and it's got seven nourishing oils in there to really keep your. I didn't do that very neatly, did How I? How much are these? These are 25. Okay. So they're, again, not cheap, but I mean, how much is the Chanel lipstick? Well, I think they vary now from sort of 22 up to 30. Yeah, All of so these kind of similar, it, it's kind of how I look at it. It's Chanel, mm. Hourglass, it's premium, you know, it's Tom Ford. Again, it's Japanese technology, so it's Japanese. that Asian technology. And I'm just going to show you quickly. I if you don't know, Suku is part of Kanabo, which yeah. if you've been around as long as we have, you'll know used to be huge here um, a lot but now you, it's really hard to find i'll swatch these afterwards because it might take a little this, bit of time i want that pink this Thank you, is um, one of the new palettes and i think this isn't even in store yet it's coming in store um, four gorgeous colors and this has got silicone I'm gonna read this so I get this right and you can tell me why it has it it's got silicone coated powders and then amino acid coated pigments so the reason and this is the sort of thing you get with this kind of technology the reason it has these pigments is that they then roll across the skin to give even cover. Yeah. We've all used those eyeshadow palettes, particularly if they tend to be some darker colours or brighter colours like that, and you put it on and it's all patchy. Yeah. And that is when you just literally have powder pigment. Oh. Uh, whereas if you have a coated powder pigment, amino acids, it basically rolls, it smooths, it helps to smooth out Kind of so the amino because... acids working on the, the eyelid as well, exactly. so again another kind of skincare benefit. Yeah. So you end up with that smooth finish as opposed to a patchy, yeah. 
But can we just Smoky have a eye. moment to look at the packaging? Yeah. Oh my god, I am a packaging freak. I love it. Just love it. It's beautiful. Okay. So that's only in Selfridges, yeah? These items are only yep. in Selfridges. These are Selfridges exclusive. You can buy them on Phoenix, isn't it, as well? I think it um, probably is. I think it's in other places. But these are the Selfridges exclusives at the moment. As I say, some of them. I only got these products this week. And as you mentioned, some of these things are coming in. Um, Christmas. Yeah, Christmas is kind of starting um, this weekend. But as soon, if I can't put links to the palette, I'll link to the Selfridges page and then you can go on and, mm -hmm. and have a look as soon as it's launched. Okay, okay over to you. Right, Sorry, my final product, we always used to joke, but Neon's back. Mm. Now, um, I'm going to go over this product, this is one of their newer products, I'm going to go over it quite loosely. Please, if you're a Neod fan, you know this, go and check out DCM's website. All the technological, geeky information is there, and there's a lot about this product, because this is Survival 30. Um, they have, I think, four of these products, Survival I haven't 10, seen any of these. 20, 30, and a zero. They are a form of SPF. Um, Do they not call it an SPF? Not really, no. Um, they are silicone dispersed, so you end up with, again, a really smooth finish. So it acts like a bit of a primer. So um, the Zero you can use at night or if you're just in the house because it gives environmental protection. And then the 10, 20 and 30 will give environmental and UVA and UVB protection. Now, what I want to show you, I don't have enough hands, is you might not be able to see that. It is very, very slightly tinted. Now, that's not tinted I'm as in, yeah, I've got a lot on. It's not tinted as in it's going to give you a tinted effect. It's actually the ingredients that give it that colour. It's got an interesting feel. Hasn't yeah, it? it has an imperceptible feel, I think. It kind of disappears. It's a bit like... It's, yeah, it's... it's... I don't even know how to describe Completely it. Completely gone in. Um, so quite silky. Very silky. Um, it doesn't feel like a serum as such though. No, it? not really, but it's not like a thick SPF. Um, this has, uh, this one is 25, that's the 30, and the zero is 20 and the others are in between. Uh, 20 pound that is, so this one's 25. Um, has it got cinnamon in it? It smells like cinnamon. No, it has, no, it has, I'm just going to read this. It has lutein from marigold, which is your antioxidant. Uh, it has melanin extract in there. It has algae, um, a UVA and UVB from titanium and zinc oxide. And they're very, very fine. And then something else that we were talking about, about re recently that we both discovered we were taking is pycnogenol. Oh, God. So maritime pine extract um, is in this and it's really really antioxidant so if you want give your skin a lovely lovely yeah. feel and a glow I, and don't, makeup works, I don't know if this will show on makeup that. works really well on it um, so if you want an alternative to traditional SPFs, which as we know, um, and you can read about this in lots of different places, I'm sure we've done articles before, traditional SPF breaks down over mm -hmm. time, so um, sometimes actually can end up absorbing some of the nasty things in the air. This doesn't do that, so this is going to give you environmental and UVA and UVB protection. So if you are... Um, fairer or somewhere warmer or you want a, a higher um, effect then go for the 30 but there is a 10 and there's a 20 and then there's also a zero which as we've said um, is the one that you can wear at night or if you have an SPF that you use on your face every day that you're happy with then use the zero underneath the survival zero to give you all that other protection Sounds amazing. Um, but I've kept it quite basic. Um, please check out Desi um, Victoria Health uh, website. Look at one of Jill's newsletters. They'll have written about it on there. Um, and obviously there's more and more Desi M stores popping up now. There's one in Covent Garden. Um, there's Spitalfields. Um, I know they're opening more. So you can always go in and chat to the staff as well. So uh, Fantastic. And price? So, yeah. Price. So that one's 25. That's the most expensive, the 30. Okay. And then the zero is 20. 
and then the 10 and the 20 in between. Okay, great. Well, that's almost us done for the month. I just wanted to mention October is Breast Cancer Awareness Month, and there's lots and lots of different campaigns. You know, we'd, we'd love to support everybody if only we could. But one thing that really appeals to me is Copper Feel, because it's a great campaign that's just encouraging us to check our breasts and actually to feel for lumps and to, you know, kind of take that care of yourself you know so many people forget to do this and it's so easy if you're in the bath i mean nikki and i both love a bath i keep hearing about not together it. not together no no no, no. never together in the swimming pool together but mm-hmm. never in the bath um but a lot of people keep saying to me they're taking their baths out and i'm like no i could never do that so when you're in the bath you know just have a feel copper feel now if you bought our travel bag, you will know about Mercy Handy. It's the best little um, hand sanitizer. I, I love these. I keep them in my bag all the time because they're the perfect size. They don't dry out the hands either. I'm really funny about these things. No. You know, they ruin your nail polish so often yeah, when you buy no, the cheap no, no, ones. These don't. And at the moment, there's a limited sure. edition copper feel with this little dress on. Can you see? Protecting your boobs. So, strip, squeeze, clean, copper feel, job done. So, just have a look on the Mercy Handy website. They're £2.90. This is a limited edition. And 100% of the proceeds go to copper feel. That's good. So, please, just just go on there. I, I buy them a few at a time, keep them in my bag, because they're one of the nicest and cutest little um, hand sanitizers. In fact, I saw a policewoman with one actually fitted onto her uniform in Oxford Street because they're small and cute. So please support Copperfield and go on to the Mercy Handy Wood signed by these. Wonderful. And that's it. That's us for October. It's so nice to have you back. Thank you. I hope you're not going to be away be back for again. so long next time. I know, and then it's Christmas. So yeah, yeah next well. time we'll come back with maybe some gift ideas. We've sworn today we're never going to talk about advent calendars. Never. I'm so over. Never. I wondered what you were going to say. I'm thinking, unless, I'm thinking what you're going to say. Unless there's a gorgeous wine one. Do you know what there is? There's a gin one. I no, know. no, there's a cheese one. Oh, there's a cheese. There's pasta. I'm a cheese honest, advent calendar. All I saw online from my birthday is the first of September. From starting then, there's people talking about advent calendars. It's just. Ridiculous. So Crazy. yeah, no advent calendars here. But yeah, yeah we'll definitely be start talking maybe a little bit more about gifting. And even, you know, traditional products that we think make perfect gifts. Um, so you can start adding them to your list or treating yourself. So Treat yourself. Yeah, Treat yourself for Christmas. Yeah. Thank you for watching. Any questions, please just drop them below the video or email info at fighting50.co.uk and hopefully we'll have Nikki back next month. If not, we'll have you back we'll, very we'll, soon. We'll free up a day, definitely. definitely. Thanks for watching. Take care, guys. Bye. Bye.